Welcome to Tennis Spin, where we put our spin on your tennis. So an update to my opinion of the racket of the year from back in 2021. Do you remember what that was? Well, here's the update. I don't know if that racket can get any better. Stay tuned. All right, coffee sponsor of today with my big mug. <laughs> my buddy, Mike Lee, who brought me three of these mugs and said, Merry Christmas to the fam. So I got the signature yellow as my favorite and we put our logo on it. And I was like, dude, thank you. Thank you so much. Uh, he wanted, as a part of my New Year's resolution, to help save the planet a little bit. So, yeah, I, I walked over to Pete's with this and I said, small coffee in here, please. Or actually, I said, small dark roast in here, please. And literally, this is full. Like, full, full. I'm not even going to open this because it was just spilling out of here. I think a small would have been like right there. This is like right here. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know if I can finish all this. <laughs> but at least it'll keep it hot. <laughs> Thank you, Mike Lee. I appreciate you, buddy. If you want to be my coffee sponsor of the day, network is buymeacoffee.com forward slash tennis spin. If you want to support the channel, Hook us up with super thanks. There's a link below. And you can contribute as much or as little as you like. All right? Thank you guys so, so much. I might be holding this tomorrow morning and Mike will still be my sponsor. <laughs> That's hot still. And it's been sitting here for 30 minutes already. <laughs> okay. Burn my mouth. Mike, that thing works. Thank you. Okay. All right, VCore 98 in the house. So I, I deem this, well, the old version, the 2021 racket of the year. And a lot of you listened, because a lot of you bought it from me. Um, my buddies bought it from me, and they're still using it today. So I was like, this is gonna be a hard update um, to make better. But as you can see, it's here. The first thing I notice is the cosmetics are better. Yeah. Looks are half the battle, isn't it? Uh, the blue with the black. So they're starting to eliminate a lot of the red that, uh, that was in the older version. So less red, more in the blues, and blacks are now a little more incorporated in here. Everybody I've showed this racket to, they're like, I love the colors. Number one thing, I love the colors. Um, well, you're probably going to love the spin because the story of this racket is going to be spin. Spin with control, though. So this racket is going to be rivaling the Alcarez racket, going to be rivaling the Extreme Tour, which was last year's racket of the year, in my opinion. So Spin Machine 95 version, you got a rival, baby. As you can see, it's kind of squarish round. Hmm. I'm interested to try and I'm very excited to try that. Let's take a look at the vitals. 323, 325, 318. Yeah, that's, that's a little interesting right there, 62. I was hoping it'd be a little higher, just a little. Um, the beam, 23, 23, 21. Stable, stable, flex. This probably correlates with each other right there. That 21 is probably where that flex is coming from. Um, so let's get this puppy strung up. Let's see if Goo's available. We'll test it out with him and see what we think for maybe Rack of the Year 2023. See you on the court.
All right, so just got off the court. Mm -hmm. Vcore 98. I'm pretty impressed. What do you think? I am samely impressed as with Harry. Um, but yeah, this racket definitely was a great update as well. Um, Yonex actually did a great job updating, in my opinion, all the rackets they have had so far. Um, this puppy actually plays or has more stability than the older version. It has more stability than the older version. It has better feel. You actually feel the racket giving the spin it needs and it's actually quite easy to give spin. Um, when I feel like through contact, it feels stable. Um, the weight just goes all the way through the head. Uh, there's no question about that. But overall, like playability, super easy. I think it's for people who are, you know, within the same market as this or have the old version. This is a great update. If you're looking for a racket that has a little more easy access for spin and the pop, this 98 for the Yonex this year is definitely something to look out for. Yeah, so we strung this with uh, Polytor Strike uh, mm -hmm. 125. Oh wow. At 52 pounds. So that was a great combination for oh, yes. this racket. I, it definitely, like it had, that, the strings definitely played a huge factor with the racket as well. So, and it, you know, it created the nice spin that everyone wanted. Great um, pocketing. Great pocketing too, yeah. And like I honestly say, like Yonex, for the past few years been doing a great job with the updates this is a that last one was racket of the year for me a couple years ago yeah this is like this is going to be hard to beat for racket of the year 2023 yeah. like, i have to say i think yonex <laughs> this year definitely blew itself out of the water again um with especially with the updates of the e-zone and now with the v chorus i could see why yonex is now part of the big I would say big, was it three now? Big four? Uh, big four. Big four Numero now. Numero four still. Yeah, number four. But it could surpass. It could surpass head, in my opinion, by with, the, with their rackets and their technology lately. This is going to take off. This is, yeah. this is hard. This is hard to beat for yeah. this year. So, like I said, if you are a current user of this racket, or you're, or you're in the market for a racket that has easy spin, but also nice power and control, I mean, this is the one to go for. If you're looking for that extra spin, easy enough, easy choice for me to get this. Very comfortable, guys. Yes. You will, when, you, when this goes in your hand and you start hitting with it, you'll be like, whoa, okay, this feels like a part of me. Yeah, it does, it really does. So, super shocked. So, Yonex, great job. Yeah. Great job on Rack of the Year's update. So, it could be Rack of the Year again. Could be, it's a tough one. It's, it's a tough a one. Tough one. Coach Q, thanks for reviewing that with me. Of course. Where can they find you? You can find me at agu.tennis. I'll also be posting content there as well. All right. Guys, try it out. You'll love it. If you already use this one in the current version, just buy this one. It's, it's a great update. that easy. Yeah. Guys, thank you for watching Tennis Spin, where we put our spin on your tennis. You know, most people they quit tennis because you know it's hard to find somebody to play with right i'm just i just feel so lucky to have my buddy my buddy coach rob that we have so much in common you know we're we're both kind of follically impaired and ain't that right coach rob us follically challenged friends have to hit together yes so i have coach rob if you guys need a friend and you're follically impaired or are a bearded one and looking for your bearded mate, right? Check out Player Court. They have people that look like you, play like you, maybe act like you. Check out their site. It's playercourt.com. Your tennis buddy can teach you how to twirl. Hopefully You'll get better it someday. Than that. Hopefully better than that. We'll have to keep practicing here. <laughs>